Hi guys, I tried the famous turmeric and lemon juice mask for my sports and I did this for seven days, every other day for, for two weeks. So I thought I should take you through the journey as I try to clear my very stubborn dark marks. So let's go. Uh, what you will need or rather what I used was um, the turmeric spice and I also used um, lemon juice. I did not have um fresh lemon so i just used the lemon juice i have and i will use the spoon for mixing and also my old blush brush which is broken i never use anymore so i'll be using this to apply the mask all over my face and every other affected area so for mixing this i didn't really have any uh, measurements or anything like that i was just mixing according to how much I felt would be enough for the face. So I was doing this, I was mixing this thing every day. I didn't do enough to store. So just mix your turmeric and of course the lemon juice together and um, stir it up. Stir, 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 stir. And also this can get your surface really dirty, your clothes dirty as well and your nails as well so i that's why i had that um cardboard covering thingy on top of the table so that it doesn't get dirty because yeah turmeric can get things really dirty okay so just mix it until you're happy with the consistency and however thick or light you want your mask to be i made this one a little too light but well, it's okay. It did the job. So let's just keep mixing and mixing and mixing. So this was my skin before the breakouts. And we're trying to get back to this. Like, my skin and I were very happy. We were in a very good space. Until, I don't know what happened. I had crazy breakouts. It was a nightmare. My skin was breaking out every day. And it was crazy. I, goodness. Apparently, it's hormonal acne. I had never had such a breakout before, so this was the worst. And it left really stubborn marks. It was all over my cheeks, on my chin, and yeah, it was crazy. So, okay, this is day one. And this is how my skin was currently looking was looking at the time when I started the mask. So this was um, the scars that the breakout left, the scars that we are trying to clear out with the mask that we just created. So my forehead was clear. It was just my chin and my cheeks. My forehead wasn't that bad. I didn't really break out in my forehead. I just had pimples here and there. So I had to put something on because, yeah, the turmeric can be dangerous. So I wore this uh, t-shirt I got in my grade 7 farewell that was in 2010. I'm excited because I kept it that long. So um, the mixture, the mask that we just mixed is what we are going to be applying all over the affected area. Um, like I said, I'm using an old blush brush. So my most prob problematic areas are my, fo um, my cheeks, my chin and my no both my cheeks and my chin so that's where i applied the mask all over i think i'm gonna use honey so that uh, i can have like that smooth thick um, consistency so that the turmeric and the um, juice are not separated like you see on the video so let's go over to day two and i got the honey that i said i was going to mix and we did the exact same thing we did yesterday. We just added some honey onto the mixture. And this is our face on day two. Not much of a difference, but yeah. We're hopeful. It's still quite the same as it was yesterday. So we'll take a closer look at what we look like. So I have applied the mask and you can see the difference with the honey. It looks a little more smoother. This is day three. I promise I don't have anything in my mouth. I just have weird chubby cheeks. And this is what we look like today as we continue. I'm having new breakouts though. Can you see the two pimples on my chin? Cheeks. Hmm, chin and cheeks. I'm having a few breakouts. 
here we go the mask is on and we are in day four there is a little bit of progress that i'm seeing i don't know if you guys can see it too but yeah we are progressing this is how we look like today in day four and we continue to put on the mask with honey i put a little bit on my forehead as well but most of it was focused on my cheeks and my chin day five i think we're looking clearer now can you see that day five not too bad not too good either but there is a little bit of a difference i see there although i have a break i have new pimples on my rise my right chin chick yeah we're back again with the mask i think i had mixed it really nice here and on the problematic areas as always it's day five and, and it's day i'm hungry six is it yeah i think we're in day six mm. And this is what we look like. I have another pimple there. I don't know if it's because of this mask that I'm getting new breakouts, but I'm not stopping. We said seven days. Seven days it is. So there's my chin there. We're going, we're going, we're going. And I have applied it on my problematic areas as always. And this is day seven. Well... I don't know. I don't know what to think. But this is where we are right now. But there is a difference from day one and today. But not really that much of a big difference. Hey guys. So um, here's an update. I have been using the mask. The turmeric and lemon juice mask. For seven days straight. Okay, not seven days straight. Every other day. So for the past 14 days I have been using the mask. And I wanted to show you how my face looks. Although we've been having like new breakouts throughout the process, so it was kind of setting back. Like if you have a look here, these are new. Uh, this one is also new. Well, my cheek hasn't really been getting anything. But yeah, I've been having new breakouts. But overall, I think this mask does work if you're patient with it, if, you consist if you're consistent and you do it probably every other day maybe for a month or so then you can like see great results but with me for the two weeks that i used it this is what i look like and um i think my old mask my old mask marks did fade away a little mm, you can see it's a little it's it's better than it was when i started if you remember the first um video though i think these masks are really oh, why am i saying masks this marks are really stubborn so um i don't know if i'm still going to continue using it because it's a lot of admin is tiring but um yeah maybe when i have free time in my hands i'll do it and if i don't but yeah this is what it is if you do want to give it a try you can and if maybe your mark your marks are not as stubborn as mine you can get away with doing this for a week and your skin will respond positively but until I see you again, please do take care and share the love. Bye.